Hello, thank you for joining us at Rockwell Automation. Today we're going to discuss the 194L family of load switches, which I prefer to call cam switches. Though suitable for UL508 motor disconnect application, the 194L is more commonly applied to switching and reversing loads, configuration, or metering applications. With up to six poles and six switch positions, it has over 35 different switch configurations, including multiple forms of on and off, changeover, and step switches. Let's step through several of the most basic uh, application and configurations. Here, this is a base mount switch, but this is a, a simple on-off. It comes in the safety red and yellow. So this could be a, a typical application would be like an at motor disconnect. So it's off and then on. It also comes in a gray and black configuration. By the way, this is a size four handle. Here's another version of switch. This is a, a changeover. And it, in this version, you can see I have a size six. Again, it has the, the red and yellow, but it also would have a, have a, a gray bezel. But it, with, with this, typically we're, we're changing the load. So in this configuration, we either, it, it's off, we go to load A or load B. So you could use this to, let, let's say, uh, uh, go from standby power application. This is a, a very common one. This is, this is a step switch. So with the step switch, we're changing loads. So we're going from load one to two, three, four, and five. This comes in multiple configurations, but very, very common in, in application. Here's a metering switch. And this, is, this particular one is, is a voltmeter switch. So we're going from A to B, B to C, A to C, and then it also switches back from A to neutral, B to neutral, and then C to neutral. Again, these come in multiple configurations as, as far as uh, application of the switch. Here are a couple of various uh, samples of on-off. Again, this is a size 4, and then this would be a, a size 6. And again, it has the European designation uh, versus an on-off. Let's speak to the individual switches themselves. On this board, we have the family of 194L switches. On the top row, these are base mount switches with ratings from 12 to 40 amps. On the second row, we have the front mount or door mount switches. Again, similar ratings, 12 to 40 amps. Let's take a little bit closer look at the individual switches. It's a base mount. It has mounting holes to mount it directly to the panel. It also has a, has a DIN rail adapter. So this could be mounted on a, on a DIN rail. The switch itself, you can see here we have the individual ratings plus the terminations, the catalog number, and then here would be the IEC ratings for the switch. The, the terminations for this come in from the, the front or the top of the switch. These are, again, base mounted. So here, this is a typical adapter. So this would, this would be a shaft adapter. And then this would be the individual uh, actuator that would be mounted on the, on the door of the panel. These are front mount switches. So the, on the front mount switch, again, this would be mounted on, on the door. So with this switch, again, the ratings for the switch here are the UL ratings. Here's the catalog number, and then the individual IEC ratings. With this, the wires are terminated, or they enter in through the back, so that the terminations are opposite of that of a base mount switch. Another switch we have, a little bit unique. This is the. This is a. Um, it comes in 32 and 40 amps. This is for a, uh, to mount in a 22 and a half millimeter push button hole. 
So typically this would be mounted like in, in a flange style enclosure, but it has a, a kind of a unique actuator here that allows it for, to adapt through the, 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 the push button hole. Let's take a look at a switch right out of the box. This is a 194L A25. So this is a, a base mount switch. A indicates a 25 amp, a 175, which is an on-off switch, and then two indicates that it's a two pole. Here again, this is what it would look like uh, within the carton. Let's open it up. Here's the instruction sheet. Let's take the individual parts out. Here's the actual base mount switch, mounting hardware, and the shaft. Um, important to know when we ship these switches, either front mount or base mount, the shaft for the actuator is supplied. The 194L switches are available in a wide range of configurations for use in many industrial applications. If you have questions regarding configuring your switch functionality, please visit us at ab.com, tap the product catalog icon, and enter 194L to select and configure your switch. Thank you again for joining us today at Rockwell Automation.